UKIP. Now let's hear the views on where we are right now from UKIP, from Stephen Wolfe. Hello, good afternoon. Uh, delay in terms of what's happening in Brussels right now, delay and delay. Uh, is that a signal to you that David Cameron is, to use his phrase, is very much battling for Britain? He wants to come back with the best deal he can get. Well, I think it's a great day for Brussels hoteliers, but not necessarily a great day for British democracy because everybody accepts that what David Cameron has sought to achieve is so low bar that he's already tripping over it. Imagine if he really did try to have some fundamental change to our relationship with Europe. If he wanted to bring back control of our borders, if he wanted to take control of the regulations, how much longer this would be. He's seeking so little and yet it's taken an age and that proves, and it should prove to the British people, that this government and any government here in the United Kingdom doesn't have control of its own destiny. That's why it's taken so long. And, and so that's, that's grist to your mill? Absolutely, of course. We have said for a long time that if you want to be positive in the future for our, our nation, if you want to look for your children and grandchildren of a world outside there where we can travel, work and trade, we should be outwardly looking, globally trading and engaging with the whole world, be positive about our economy, be positive about our people. And that must be done so by this place to our left, by control of our own parliament and our control of our own regulations, not by these long-winded negotiations over very minor changes that amount to very little. But then, but then ultimately taking that through to beyond the result of the, of the EU referendum, that, that, that could be you out of a job. I mean, you, that, that's... Well, I would be absolutely delighted if the British public decided to vote to leave the European Union and I would be out of a job as a member of the European Parliament. I could go back to being a lawyer again and then spending more time with my family. But what is really important, though, is to ensure that those people that you've had on here on the show earlier, those from the Labour Party, the Conservative Party, might have different political views to me, but they're the ones who are voted for by the people of this country and they're the ones who make the decisions about our future. That's what I want. Maybe I will challenge them in the future in a role in UKIP, perhaps. But let's give the people of this country that opportunity and let's vote to leave so Parliament becomes supreme again. All right. Uh, plenty to discuss in the coming days. Thank you very much Thank for you. now. Thank you, Stephen Wolfe.